All right, so we're downtown Corpus Christi, Texas. It is windy out here. Hopefully this isn't gonna make the video bad. But right now we're watching Yolanda, the series on Selena. So we're doing a video showcasing all the different Selena locations that they have in Corpus Christi, Texas, our hometown. So we're gonna start off, we're gonna go to the statue. So here's the South Texas Music Walk of Fame. You can see some of the stars that they have. I'm trying to find Selena. I saw Jennifer Lopez, or no, I saw Jennifer Pena. All right, so I found Selena's star. It's over here by the executive, right over here. All right, so we're over here on Bloomington and Elvira Street. Bloomington is where Selena and Chris's house was. But over here, they have a mural right over here on this Times Market. So I wanted to showcase this. This gives you an idea. This is uh, Selena's neighborhood. But here's this mural right here. The goal isn't to live forever, but to create something that will. I read that right. Ooh, special thanks to San something. Yeah, I don't know how to say that. Oh yeah. Yeah, we're gonna drive over and check out the house down at the end of the street. All right, so we came down to the end of the street, Bloomington and Arkdale here in Corpus Christi, Texas, and right across the street, this is where Selena and Chris Pettis their house was. It was at 7:05. And then right next door, that's where Selena's parents lived, the mom and dad. But yeah, you can see no trespassing. They have the gate up here, so you can't even like get close or anything. But yeah, there is the house right there. Our next location is the Hi Ho Restaurant. According to Selena's father, Abraham, this is Selena's favorite place to eat. And uh, this place, it closes early. It's one of those Mexican restaurants that opens up early and closes early. It closes like at 2.30. But I was hoping to see something Selena out here. No, I don't see anything. Do you want to go to my place now? I do. I want to eat here because my wife says she's eaten here before. My niece says they have really good breakfast tacos. But yeah. Okay, there is a sign on here that says closed. I don't know. I mean, I did hear that the place did catch on fire. Uh, yeah, I don't know. But yeah, there is a closed sign. All right, here we are at the former Selena Boutique, which is now Prime Real Estate. One of the fun facts that I learned from the Yolanda show was that Selena, what her passion was is for their boutique and for like clothing design. I always thought it was just the music, but yeah, it was saying her passion was the boutique and running the boutique. And then here's some of the closer up. The building is basically the same with the, the black and white design, our black and white paint job. This is off of Everhart. It still has the same kind of entrance and the brick right here with the window display where she would have all her clothing displayed. But this is Selena's boutique, our former Selena's boutique, which is now prime real estate. All right, so here's the Red Roof Inn. This is the location of the hotel. You can see right here, this pool. This pool is like really bad looking right here. But it used to be a Days Inn. And then right over here is 150. All right, so here's 150. Back in 1995, 
it was 158 but through all the room cha or the hotel changes and everything they relocated all the rooms so 150 is originally where it was all right so this is the room right here this is the room where it happened right here in the doorway i thought it was inside the room but it was the doorway that happened and then when she got shot selena ran across where the pool was i don't know if she went the left or the right and ran to the lobby yeah, so according to my my boys, they're saying that uh, you can't rent the room 150. That's what y'all said? Yeah. And that's it? Yeah, you cannot rent that room. You're not allowed to. So I don't know what they use it for, storage. They don't, I don't think they use my it. son thinks this area right here is where a purse on the ground for like evidence. So we're assuming she ran this way, this side, and then went to the lobby right over there. I'm not really sure. All right, our video ends here. We're at Seaside Memorial Funeral Home. And this is where the grave is for Selena. We've been here before, but I've heard that they've changed it. There's a sign right there. So you got the little pathway. You have right here where you can scan. And some of this part's missing right here, but here it is. You got the plaque right there. But this is Selena's final resting place in Corpus Christi, Texas. You can see that people laid out some flowers. I always heard the white rose was her favorite. But anyways, if any of you have a special memory of Selena meeting her, you can share in the comments. You got some beads right here that people left. But anyways, thanks for watching. Hopefully you all enjoyed.